I thoroughly coated all the surfaces here with petroleum jelly. And what that will do is, is make, it, uh, make it work smoother. I've got a screw here with a washer. This is a 3 16 washer. The whole one is a bit smaller. That goes through the outside. The plastic bushing goes on the inside. So you put that together and then I've already drilled a hole in the right spot here. It's a 1 8 inch hole and you screw it in. First I'm going to lay it on its side and uh, attach this one. It's a little bit easier. I'm going to put a washer first. And uh, slip the bushing onto the screw and uh, the washer at the top. And then throw that in. I'm going to tighten this in so it's, uh, it's just snug. You don't want it, uh, don't want it uh, clamping hard on the, the arm. The arm has to move freely. And you can see the way it works. Um, it's fairly easy. Um, it's got about an inch and a half of, uh, of uh, range. The, uh, I've already, I've already uh, put in a screw down here with another bushing. Um, that's to catch the end of the rubber bands. I've just got two of these that um, were wrapped around my paper actually. I don't normally have rubber bands, so this is something that I would probably actually go and buy a spring for. But uh, rubber bands work fine, as you can see. What I need to do um, is to uh, make a stop somewhere around here. It's just another, it's just another screw with another bushing uh, that this arm comes down against to. Uh, to stop it from coming all the way up. Also, it would be nice to put another stop over here somewhere um, to stop the arm from going down too far. But as you can see, you can adjust it from here. You can um, um, push it down a position, check it for movement, reach in through that hole that, that we drilled earlier, and. Uh, Tighten or loosen the screw as needed, and let it come up, and then you can get to the lower screw and tighten or loosen that. Now, when we put the when we put the motor tool in and put a one eighth inch uh, drill bit in here, tighten it up, and then square it to the table. You know, you take a, a square and you make sure that it's square this way. Um, the way to adjust that, if it's not square, you can see I'm pretty pretty good here, is to um, either cut the bottom of the post here, one way or the other, or shim it. You can use slips of paper, just loosen the screws, uh, put paper on one side if it has to come this way, put paper on that side if it has to go the other way, put paper on this side, and then you... Um, We'll check it for square this way also. Yeah, this one is the same same uh, deal as the back one here. It goes through in the same way. The uh, the bolt goes in. And there's a washer that goes in next. There's a nut that goes on after that. And what you do is you just uh, turn that on and you put the... Um, Put the bolt through, and once that's in, you just hold this um, and tighten the tighten the nut. And that's it. Hope you like it.